So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and type in Task Manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, if you see either Fortnite or Epic Games Launcher open, you want to close it. You might just scroll down to find it, but once you find it, you want to right click on it and then click on End Task. Then you want to head over to the Details tab and then do the same thing. If you see Fortnite or Epic Games Launcher open, you want to right click on it and then click on End Process Tree. So guys, for the next step, you want to head over to Search and type in File Explorer. Click on it. Then you want to find where you have Fortnite installed. So for me, it's on this PC, C Drive, Program Files, Fortnite, Fortnite again, Fortnite Game, Binaries, Win64. Now once you're in this folder, you want to scroll down until you see these four applications, Fortnite Client and Fortnite Launcher. You want to delete all these applications. Click on do this for all current items and then click on continue. Now once you do that, we're going to scroll back up and then you want to click on easy anti-cheat. Then you want to click on the easy anti-cheat setup. Now once you're on this, you want to uninstall easy anti-cheat. Now once you do that, you want to click on Win64 and then you want to delete the easy anti-cheat folder. Click on continue. Now once that's been done, you want to head back into Epic Games and then you want to click on the three dots on Fortnite, click on manage and then click on verify. Now after this has been done, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed. 